This year, 2014, it's the 10th year anniversary of the V4 because in 2004 we presented the first ever watch with belt transmission but at this time it was just a concept and it didn't work so well. So we worked a lot on it, we developed a unique technology patented by Targodur and in 2009 we presented the first Monaco V4 as a commercial product. So it was a platinum version and this year, so 10 years after, we will celebrate the anniversary of the V4 with a unique complication, which is a merge between autologie and avant-garde. This is the new V4 turbine. You know, here we merge the most beautiful complication with the ultimate technology, a turbine with belt. So this is for the first time ever a belt driven turbine. The benefits are first, if you have a look, you will see a very smooth rotation because usually on the turbine you have some backlash, but for the first time ever you have no backlash. Very smooth rotation thanks to the belt. And other good point for the customers is that the belts are a very efficient shock absorbing system. The first idea of the V4 is to have a design very close to the one of a car engine. This is the main idea. That's why if you look at the back of the watch, you have four barrels with a linear rewinding system. So quite the same design than the car engine. And this is the main idea. So we kept the DNA of the Monaco V4, square case and four barrels with, with linear rewinding system. Two belts on the back, two belts on the front. And now for this tourbillon, it was a big challenge because the tourbillon is much more heavy than a regular uh, regulation system because you have only a balance wheel on an ordinary watch, but with the tourbillon you have more than 40 components, so it's quite heavy and you have to find the good shape for the belt, the good material and the good number of teeth. Because you know that this belt uh, has the size of a human hair and on this human hair you have around 300 teeth. So quite hard to, to fine tune. So it was a, a teamwork between the watchmaker and the engineers to find this solution. The case is uh, made in titanium because it's very light and we made a PVT coating on it to have this black aspect. And yes, the strap is an alligator strap, alligator soft touch for the more avant-garde side of the look. We are the only one to break the rules with new technology like that. We are the only one to change the way of transmit the energy on a watch. And so this is something very unique and you buy a piece of history because the Monaco before is very really an icon and a piece of history.